Now, one other thing we like to do is see if the person's hydrated, because if your clients are not hydrated, like the muscles are like over 70% water, um, the lungs are over 80% water, the heart, you, your brain has such a, a vital need for water. Here's a way you can muscle test to see if a person needs to hydrate. So as I push here, I want you, well, I can do it or she can do it. I tug on the hair so it stretches the skin and I test again, it's strong. If that isn't, when you're working with someone, have them drink some water. So now we're going to look at, I've got this indicator muscle and it could be any muscle. I could have the arm out like this or the other arm, but your shoulder doesn't have any challenges, right? She told me, but you would want to do it on an arm and a shoulder that is okay. So now we've got a indicator test here. So we use muscle testing again to find out where there's energy blockage. Now every symptom has some form of energy blockage. And often when you clear the blockage, the symptom goes away naturally. Write that, the symptom will go away naturally. And now I want you, where, I think you said you had some challenges in your ear, was that right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so what, Tell me that the challenge is, the, the problem, what, what is it? I just keep getting water in it and it's like stuck and I put like a swimmer's ear thing in it ah. and it just kind of made it worse and oh. I keep okay. surfing and more water gets in it. Okay, so you don't want to give up surfing, you just want to fix the ear, right?